hey guys what's up welcome back to my channel so as you can see i've got another vlog for you guys today and um, this one's actually down to my dad so last night he was saying to me that today he's going to go to the storage place to get the final bits outside of there and then he was just also saying how basically um it'd be a good idea if i came along and vlogged it basically to show the ending process of what i move and just to show how good it's been to have you know a storage place to have our stuff now i'm um, having this storage has meant that you know on completion day we don't have to be worried about moving every single thing from our previous this house of this place because our old house we lived there for 21 years so like that's a super long time and you can imagine the amount of stuff that we had in there memorabilia and just all kinds of things that we've you know accumulated over the years so yeah definitely like having storage is a good way to go if you're moving house you don't have to worry that the removal truck may not be able to move every single thing that's not a problem taking out storage also means that you can sort of take your time with the move and sort of ease yourself into the new place so like with us we had so much stuff that if we literally tried to move every single thing from our old house into this new place it would have just been so overwhelming woman in terms of trying to unpack everything into this new house and sort of placing it where everything needs to go so having this storage has meant that you know bit by bit we can sort of tackle things not just think you know we've got a whole load of stuff here sitting in the living room or in the kitchen or in our bedrooms and we don't know what to do with it so yeah i just thought i'd highlight you know some of the advantages of taking out storage if you are moving before we get onto that side of things so it's about 10 50 now my dad said he wants to go to storage at 11 so i'm just gonna wait for him to um, basically be ready and then we'll get a move on um in terms of other things i need to do today it's gonna be a very much like life admin type day so um when i come back i need to wash my hair because i'm actually getting it braided tomorrow so i want to wash it first thing because i'm going to leave it to air dry i don't want to use like artificial heat i don't want to use the hair dryer one that like it's not great for your hair but more importantly I don't have the time for that stress because it's like when you use a hair dryer then it creates mess hair goes everywhere then you have to clean up after yourself and I'm all about you know easy living nowadays so yeah I want to do that and um, give it time to air dry before tonight because I don't want to sleep with like wet hair and get it all over my pillow and stuff so that's that um after that as well i want to check up on the ads that i've been running on facebook so basically i've been running some facebook ads for the property sourcing business just to try and get more of a reach and get more um, conversion in terms of people signing up for the service then as well as that i'm also going to be partially editing this vlog that you're watching right here so this vlog is going to go up on sunday morning so right now as i'm recording this it is what day is it so right now as i'm recording this it is friday so obviously the timelines are quite tight i've literally been trying to play catch up over the last few days so hopefully by the end of this week you no know, by the end of this week i'll be back on track with everything and i won't have to be rushing to create content and get it out that's enough waffling i believe i've i've talked enough let's get on to storage looking forward to the day when we no longer have to wear these masks. Oh my gosh, these things are actually so awkward to push. Do not be deceived. So because they put their name on the panel, that's why it's trash Who needs their name on the panel to lock up the thing? Yeah, but if you had your own padlock on you, wouldn't you have used it? No, you can use your own padlock, but what I'm saying is that if something goes wrong, well, you might be able to say, well, maybe the padlock you, you use is not, mm. it's not, it's not secure enough. You know, just like insurances will always have an excuse. 
So this is all that's remaining. There's nothing here. You basically. need to have seen this place, you know, before now. Imagine all those boxes that have been bought home. Yeah. All stacked here. You know, it's like, I mean, imagine we are talking like up to 40, 50 boxes. Yeah. Which over the weeks have been taken. Wow. You know, bits and bits. And these are nice snaps. No more boxes, just all these uh, little things. Little bits and pieces. Yeah, this chair. Shoes. Will, I think this chair will go to our. This is what we'll be using on our, in the back corner of our room. Okay. But it won't go there now because of the rain. Until I can get uh, that cover for the dry this will be used in our balcony. Hannah's guitar from when she was young. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so. Done. And. Goodbye, storage. Yeah, goodbye, storage. That's two the last one, of it. Two, sorry, 2129. I'm going to go. I'm not going to lock it, I'm going to go to the panel to them and ask them what do they want me to do with it. Oh my gosh guys, the struggle with this trolley thing was even worse on the way back. So although that was the last of it at storage, there's still quite a few boxes left in the living room that my mum saw in through. So we are back home now and um, yeah, I'm going to get on to washing my hair. Um, actually, you know, before I do that, I'm going to quickly have some toast or something because I'm really hungry. It's about one o'clock now, I think. I haven't had any breakfast. Just had the coffee this morning. Um, yeah, so um, yeah, washing my hair, it's a shame really because I've literally just washed my hair like a week ago and I'm only having to wash it again because I'm going to braid it tomorrow. And also I've been putting gel on my hair to like slick it back like this so um yeah I'm gonna have to wash my hair and I want to get out of the way now because as I said I'm gonna air dry it so I'm gonna put in some plaques to air dry it and I don't want it to be drying overnight and like with my pillow and stuff so um yeah I'm gonna do that in a bit have some food first and then get on with everything else Right, so guys, as I said, I've been running some ads, some Facebook ads to go across Facebook as well as Instagram, just because I've noticed that my reach on Instagram has not been that great. So obviously trying to get like traction in terms of people signing up to the property sourcing service via Instagram has not been that great. So yeah, I'm running these ads. I've currently got three ads going, as you'll see here. I've currently spent £3.74 up till date. So one of these ads I started two days ago, which is this bottom one here. So that one, it's got a reach of six. 611 people and then 15 link clicks so i think that's doing okay actually and i've only spent two pound 63 on that so far so not bad um these two i created yesterday so obviously it's a bit it's a bit premature to try and gauge whether they're doing that well or not or whether they're really converting but um as it stands this one i created last night it's got two link clicks reached 423 people this one not doing so well in comparison only reached 145 people and we've got zero link clicks i guess it's still loading up so yeah i'm doing some ads hopefully be able to get more sign ups via this means and that's what things are looking like on this front really so hopefully um, over the coming days and as well as obviously people trying to get properties before the stamp duty holiday you know ends I'll be able to get some more sign-ups for the property sourcing service that way. Okay, so I've now washed my hair and I'm just going to add some leave-in conditioner. And it's the Cantu Deep Treatment Mask. Can you guys see that? So this one I'm currently using. Usually I'd leave it on for a couple of hours just so they can really penetrate into like the hair and stuff. But um, I don't need to because again, I just washed my hair last week. So I did all of that last week. So I'll just put it in for maybe 10 minutes and um yeah get on get on with things so now the hair's washed um conditioned and rinsed out 
So now I'm just going to pour it into four sections and put some more oils in it, moisturiser and leave it to dry. So guys, it is now a few hours since I spoke to you last, so it's now like six o'clock. So unfortunately, I've not been able to get any editing done. And that is because Apple do not want me to win today. So I've been having like network issues with my laptop for the past couple of weeks. But over the last two days, it's really intensified. Today, I literally cannot connect. I don't know what is going on. I've tried to restart my laptop. I've done the update. So I've turned my Wi-Fi on and off. Like it's just not working. And the reason why I need network so, so much is because I was using my um, phone camera to vlog and then it came of that notification telling me that all my memory is full so all i wanted to do was do an icloud download of everything onto my external hard drive and then that would be able to free up the phone but no i couldn't do that because i have no connectivity so it's been really annoying very frustrating and obviously like um what i wanted to record next in terms of like my video editing it comes out clearer when i use my phone camera to record as opposed to using this camera that i'm recording with so yeah that's why i like I'm just hesitant to even try and use this current camera because I just feel like it's just not going to come out the way I want it to. So um, yeah, I really need to crack on with editing this vlog now because if I don't, there's not going to be anything up on Sunday for you to watch. So I think I'm just going to cut this vlog short for today. Hopefully you've enjoyed it anyway. If you have done, please do give it a thumbs up. And then um, please do also remember to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. So um, thank you for watching and I'll catch you later. Bye.